Okay, so this is a video to help us in understanding what we're doing when we're doing long division. First of all, we have to write out the problem where we're dividing by 35, and then write out separately the 35 times table. So we're going to write out up to 9 what each of these numbers are multiplied by 35. Now the reason this is easy is because you are just writing down the number 35 and then adding 35 to the number above to get your times table. It makes it a lot easier when we're going through the process if you have all these numbers written out already. So that's the first step. Now we've done that. We're going to look at the first two digits, 95. We are going to find out how many 35s there are in 95. We look down our list of blue numbers until we get to the, the last number before we hit 95, and that's 70. We write down 70 underneath 95, and the number next to it in the circle, 2, on the top line, there are two 35s in 95. And the remainder is 25. Now we found that through subtraction. We're bringing down the 3 from the top line, and we're going to go through the process again. How many 35s are there in 253? Now the first number before we get to 253 is 245. On the top line, we write the 7. And underneath 253, we write 245, and we do the subtraction, and this time it gives us 8. We bring down the 1 from the top line to sit next to the 8, and we go through the process for a third time. How many 35s are there in 81? Well, looking down our times table, 70 is the number before we get to 81. So we write 70 underneath 81 and 2 on the top line. And we do our subtraction for the final time. We get the number 11, and this is our remainder. The answer on the top line is what our answer is, with remainder 11. So we could answer our question by putting 272 remainder 11.